Samsung is wrapping up April 2025 with a massive One UI 7 rollout, and the momentum is set to continue well into May. The update is going to be huge, with flagships getting the major upgrade. And it's not just limited to the high-end devices, mid-range and budget models will be getting their share of visual enhancements too. So what's the deal with One UI 7? It's bringing Android 15 to Samsung Galaxy devices, and the initial rollout began in mid-April 2025. But the real expansion is about to hit in May, and it's going to cover a wide range of Samsung devices, including some that got a jumpstart in April itself. Here's what you need to know about the global rollout and which devices are getting the update. One UI 7, global expansion. Samsung kicked things off earlier than expected, starting the rollout in South Korea. Now the update has already reached several devices that were scheduled for May, including in the US and global markets. Here are the flagships that are already getting One UI 7, or will soon. Galaxy S series, Galaxy S21, S21 Plus, S21 Ultra, S21 FE, Galaxy S22, S22 Plus, S22 Ultra, Galaxy S23, S23 Plus, S23 Ultra, S23 FE, Galaxy S24, S24 Plus, S24 Ultra, S24 FE, Galaxy Z Series, Galaxy Z Fold 3, Z Flip 3, Galaxy Z Fold 4, Z Flip 4, Galaxy Z Fold 5, Z Flip 5, Galaxy Z Fold 6, Z Flip 6, Galaxy Tab S Series, Galaxy Tab S8, Tab S8 Plus, Tab S8 Ultra, Galaxy Tab S9, Tab S9 Plus, Tab S9 Ultra, Galaxy Tab S10 Plus, Tab S10 Ultra, Devices getting One UI 7 in May 2025. It's not just the premium devices getting the love. Samsung is speeding up the rollout and going ahead of schedule. Many devices originally expected to get the update in May have already started receiving One UI 7 in April, and more devices will follow soon. Here's a look at some of the mid-range and budget models that will start receiving the update. Galaxy A series, Galaxy A55, A35, A54, A34. Galaxy N series, Galaxy M55, M35, M54, M34, Galaxy F series, Galaxy F55, F54, F34, Galaxy Tab S FE series, Galaxy Tab S9 FE, Tab S9 FE Plus. What to expect in May? The One UI 7 update for these devices is set to land soon, but remember, there could be delays if any issues come up during internal testing before the public rollout. While this isn't an official schedule from Samsung, it's based on rollout trends and their fast-track strategy for the One UI 7 expansion. So are you excited for the One UI 7 update? Let me know in the comments which device you're using and whether you've received the update already. If you haven't, be patient, it's coming soon. Samsung's One UI 7 update first landed on the Galaxy S24 and its S25 series and is now being extended to the Galaxy S23 series. However, many S23 users are reporting serious bugs and performance issues, raising concerns about the stability of the new software. A user on the Samsung forum shared, always on display is not working properly. The battery icon and clock are glitching in AOB mode. Also, the charging information keeps changing positions on the lock screen. It feels like Samsung rushed this update. It's very disappointing to face such issues on a flagship phone like the S23 Ultra. Even Galaxy S24 Ultra users are reporting unusual problems. One wrote, after updating my S24 Ultra, I started noticing a noise coming from the charger. I'm using a 25 watt Samsung charger. When I charge other devices like the Galaxy A55 or Tab S7, there's no noise. But with the S24 Ultra on One UI 7, the charger starts making a sound after a while. Is anyone else experiencing this or is it just me? Another user posted a screenshot and commented, After the One UI 7 beta program ended and the stable update was released, I'd noticed lots of bugs, battery drain, and heating issues. Please look into this and provide a hotfix to resolve the problems in the quick settings panel. An S23 Ultra owner wrote, Since updating to the One UI 7 stable version, my phone has slowed down, started hanging, heating up, and the battery is draining very fast. It was performing perfectly before the update. 
Is anyone else experiencing the same issues? Another user expressed frustration over a long-standing issue. I've been hoping Samsung would make the default font work properly across all apps like WhatsApp and YouTube, but they still haven't fixed it. It's really frustrating and makes the user interface feel unfinished. The hype around One UI 7 feels underwhelming because of these integration problems. Another S23 Ultra user shared their concern, just updated to One UI 7 on my S23 Ultra. While the update looks good, the device is heating up a lot and the battery is draining very quickly. Samsung needs to address this urgently with a fix. Are you facing any issues? Let me know in the comments section.